Hello Libra, welcome to my channel. Welcome to the reading for the month of November. For this reading I'm using the coffee cup and then I'll be drawing out cards from the Gilded Tarot deck here. And then I will be also drawing out uh, a card from the beautiful Seasons of the Witch Oracle deck as well. Okay, Libra, lovely Libras. Remember to like, share, subscribe please if you haven't done so already. Okay, Libra, Libra. <laughs> There is a lot of momentum behind something that I see you charging ahead with a project, something that you are passionate about, something here that is opening up doors. It's You are starting to really feel it and it's linked to an emotional side of you as well. Something to do with matters of the heart. It's like a, it's a combination of things. This isn't just one area in your life, you know, it's two or three perhaps um, but it feels like things are starting to arise and balance out and it will feel like oh you know maybe like you've been rushed off you feel lots of things happening maybe it feels like oh all of a sudden I need to like get all of this done and 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 yeah, I do also see you uh uh being invited to different places it's like all it's like when it rains it pours that's what it looks like over here <laughs> many things happening all at once and you're needing to you know just um ha ha having to to deal with it all at once you know but it's it's all good stuff it's all good stuff you just may feel like you rushed off your feet but all good um there's something that you are going to gain or being granted and it's not something that you thought it's like you didn't think about it too much but it's there um it, it's like something that was at the back of your head but it happens and it's like oh you barely put any attention towards this but you know it's starting to come through and it's because it, ha it has had the least resistance so there's something very peculiar about this. You know, you didn't think about it too much. It's something that you you thought would be nice to have. And it like there's an increase of it. It happens, if that makes sense. Um, there is, this could be just for some, there's something here that you're going to stop doing, no longer continuing with, realizing that perhaps, you know, it has it been worth the energy that you've been putting in, whatever it may be, you're like, mm, you've, you're deciding to let something go. Um, and it, it doesn't, you don't lose anything with it. If anything, you'll see increases in other uh, areas in your life. You know, so this particular thing perhaps has just been too distracting or takes away from a lot of your energy rather than you focusing on what you need to focus on. Um, I do see there's something about uh, an environment or some others around you that feel a little bit superficial and you're not engaging with that anymore. Something here that you wish to just leave behind, walk away from and walking away from freely. I, I feel like here you, you, you gain that freedom um, and you definitely learn a lot from that as well. Um, I see multitasking, multitasking. Like I said, kind of like rushed off your feet, you know, uh, multitasking, r running around everywhere. But it's something about that feels exciting. Uh, this is not in any way um, something bad. This is all good because many things are starting to go forward that's why now matters of the heart something here feels very i do see for some of you your heart is beating quite fast when it comes to matters of the heart with with somebody someone is going to be a lot more engaging here um feeling very that feels very charged all of that this sort of chemistry connection here that you have there's an end of a chapter there's something here that you, you know, this new beginning of a chapter, um, like you've looked everything through and you're making sure that nothing gets ruined. This is a, a chance to start this new chapter in a way that, you know, um, you haven't really felt before. 
And with, with some of you, it is with someone else as well. There's a tree here growing and it's growing beautifully and it's growing, growing accordingly as well. It's not all over the place. It's, it's, it's abundant. It's clean. You know, meaning that you are receiving lots of rewards here. The fruits of your labor here is starting to really come through and you get to really enjoy that as well. You've been planting some seeds, some seeds here that you've been planting along the way um, is starting to, to come through as well. I do see some sort of apology coming in for you, Libra. And it does show it's very much up to you whether you want to take it or not. Um you may take it, but it doesn't mean that you're going to reconnect. It's just some sort of uh, apology, and that's, you know, for for them. All right. Oh, Queen of Swords. Oh, come out right away. <laughs> Queen of Swords. All right, Libra, Libra. <laughs> I do see there's a, definitely, again, a message that's coming through about an increase in, in uh, all those areas that you've been wanting to see an increase. There's something here coming through. Okay. Oh, Queen of Swords, Knight of Swords, and the Nine of Pentacles. <sighs> Love that. Okay, Queen of Swords, Knight of Swords, and the... I, I said Queen of Pentacles, Nine of Pentacles. I'm not sure if I did, but Queen of Swords, Knight of Swords, Nine of Pentacles. Things are definitely coming together, and they're coming together very, very strongly as well. There is something that's clear, like paved the way for you. It's 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 cleared your path. Um, something I do get that was very painful in the past is being cleared away. Something is being cleared, cleansed. Um, and a message I'm getting is like maybe it's a time to forgive. But again, it doesn't mean you're going to reconnect. After this, whatever it is that's been transpiring and you're in this fresh start, things are going to move very, very quickly. Your prosperity is rising as well. Um, there is something that you will gain from from how you've been living your life with there's a certain type of independence here that you've really really enjoyed but there is also there's something about that here that you are gaining from some type of knowledge that perhaps others don't or, or an experience that others haven't and they wish they would if you know what I mean you're being put in a position that is very powerful and you're lucky in many many ways it's like you have something that um, really helps you be at the uh, at the forefront for it gives you like an upper hand um, I do see you know again something is charging ahead there's this very strong energy that is charging ahead You know, and it, it's and it's important to just continue going with that flow. Three of Pentacles and the Empress. Okay, Three of Pentacles and the Empress. And I do see you are being recognized for the work that you have been putting in, the practice, the amount of hours, the energy. There's something here that is expanding, whether that's a promotion, you're going up, you better responsibilities um or, you know or just connecting with others like a, um, a team teamwork to really help something happen to help achieve a particular um a dream here for you you know knowing that i do see here you're going to be on top of on top of many things here something here that i see others are cheering you on with but you you know you are <sighs> very passionate again i get something about your passions coming alive things don't feel as burdensome anymore burden burdens burden burdensome <laughs> anymore i get the message of you know we're talking about that superficial kind of environment um, the flakiness is what I'm seeing here. You're not, you're, you're moving away from that. That's not going to be the case anymore with this kind of, um, you, you're doing things your own way is what I'm seeing. You're definitely doing things your own way. 
in in a way that you it's like you've been following your intuition and it's something that feels right for you i also see that something that felt very unknown is coming through and all of that just puts you in a position of authority or having that leadership role here and being very very open and there are many opportunities that i see you saying yes to the king of cups all right the king of cups oh i do get somebody coming in that suits you very very much a great suitor of some kind whether that is a particular job or a person but something feels like what i'm getting oh it's about time that's what i see here you are receiving financial blessings as well as emotional blessings here you know your cup will always be full there is a certain gesture somebody's coming in with with um very kind gestures loving gestures here that you know is again i see you kind of looking at it and going oh that's also about time <laughs> <laughs> it feels good you're going with it let's see what the oracle card has for you fertilizing Ooh. food is not the only thing that nourishes you dear one be mindful of what you feed your soul absolutely and again here like with the empress you know it shows that kind of um fertility that abundance that growth but always be mindful absolutely of what you allow to to you know feed yourself where you um uh spend your time your energy the kind of environment that's exactly what we're talking about moving away from that superficial kind of environment into something that is genuine something that you uh, are open to receive and it enters your life i love that thank you so very much libra for being here truly hope that this was helpful please please do let me know appreciate all of you so very much from the bottom of my heart thank you so much for all your support do take care and until next time